Uh, good evening. Uh, today video I show you how to install WinCC Runtime Professional version 14 service part 1 of WinCC Runtime Advanced. Uh, thank you for watching Win Swan Key Automation. Okay, before installation, I need to introduce step by step of the package in WinCC in TIA portal version 14. Okay, when you download WinCC uh, TIA portals from the internet, you could have many folder inside. So, which to in which packets to install? There are so many packets here. It's very very messy. Okay, uh, there are so many video on the internet. They show how to install WinCC or TIA portal, but they don't is plans clearly what the package meaning okay before introducing how you install with the run times I will explain a little bit about this package number one the third you install step 7 version 14 professional so when you install when uh, step seven, you will have WinCC basic, including in this bucket. Or number two, when you install version WinCC version fourteen, you will have step seven basic inside, including this one, packets. So number one, install step seven professional, and number two, install version fourteen. So in WinGC version 14, you will have the professional runtime simulation only. The third one is on 7 S7 simulation. This one for simulation. So WinGC professional, we have the configuration only and simulate runtime simulation. So WinCC Runtime Professional is for operation and option packets such as WinCC Web Navigators, Data Monitors, OPC Server, UA, DAs. Okay, next time when we install, we can see the clear list about the packets inside WinCC Runtime Professional. Okay, WinCC Advanced Runtime and WinCC, sorry that, WinCC Advanced and WinCC Professional. What is different of them? Okay, you can see from here. Symbolic WinCC Runtime Advanced Available at a software package with defined maximum of power tags. The term power tag is used to identify process variable and are point pointed that have a process linked to the controller. Okay? So if we want to increase the power tag, upgrade the tower tag, we give you runtime professional available. Now compare with WinCC version 14 and TAA portal WinCC version for uh, 7.4 Okay, I open PCS 7 and C In the WinCC we have WinCC runtime for operation WinCC configuration for programming for configuration Even though we also have this option package for WinCC site like uh, WinCC OPC server, WinCC smart tools, WinCC web navigators, WinCC web UX, OPC UIs, web navigator data monitors, everything like this. 
So in WinCC, sorry, in TIA portals, WinCC version 14 service path or run first path one run times, we will have other option. Okay, uh, now we start. In the WinCC runtime, we have DVD1. Uh, after extractions, we have uh, modify before installation. We need to modify so modify this. Sorry, re resources. Uh, uh, in the resources, we have the ini2.ini's. If we don't modify this command, we cannot install. We will have alarm like this, warning like this. WinCC Runtime Professional version 14 service part one require WinCC Runtime Professional version 14 installation requires requirement system is unable to locate this version on the computers. If we don't modify modify this uh, this uh, file command so we cannot install we will have the warning so I show you how to modify this file in the video I will upload this file for all of you to download and copy paste into the resources folder only you don't do anything okay I open this one I show you notepads uh, to bypass the warning, we need to go to term. Okay. Okay. Uh, in the term sections, between the term and one zero three trees, we have so many command here. We to on command and delete and save file. In this file, I already already delete it. So we don't have anything here. Okay. After delete it and we save files, override the files inside. Okay. I will open the original file for you to see. Originals. Okay. Here. I copy paste and see. Before before modification, we need to back up this file to prevent any mistake. You know, if we make the uh, the file wrong, you will mm, you cannot install term. Sorry, that we need to put on the top. Okay. Terms. Okay. We go to term section. In the term section, we have many instructions here, command here. We choose all of them until 1033 here. I select on and delete. Okay, delete on this one and save the files. Save as you know, we go to the install data and resources and save. Sorry, that you want to open test on a test. Okay, don't save. Okay, uh, after modified, uh, that's fine. You can easily to install. Now I start installation. Go to network. I have the TIA server with Windows servers. Let's see, that's computers. Okay, Windows Server 2016. Right click, properties. Okay, Windows Server 2016. You know the TIA's portal support Windows Server 2016 standard. 
my old PCs. Okay, we go to uh, WinTC service part one professional run times to DVD one, right? Start run. Uh, we wait until programming started. Uh, you know TIA portal that is the uh, total integrated automation. So it is very very useful for you to configure some complicated project with many type of LMIs uh, or many pieces. It supported any limitation to download the programming the configuration from any station to server or to client it is different from schematic managers and quintc version 7 uh, you, uh, TA portal is is uh, developed and it's make look like the same PCS7 so it means that we have the any station pieces we have the uh, project we call master project and then we can download the project to server, download project to client. Okay. In the in the Win CC version seven, you cannot download to server or client. You need to use uh, duplicate this project from any station to server. And uh, in the duplicated, you use. Uh, okay, I will show you later. You you uh, save as to copy the program to server uh, between between uh, redundant server. You need to use duplicators. Okay. Okay, uh, we start uh, installing TIA portals version fourteen service part one. Uh, right click. Uh, start. Click start. And wait. And in, you need to align things. Okay. After you need to align things, come click, click next installation version. And we choose the language. Now uh, in my project, I use English. And click next. Okay. In the WinGC runtimes we have there we install a server we use we see runtimes if we install what on a client we use runtime client uh, and you see that uh, we have web navigators we choose on an option and semantic WinTC web UX semantic WinTC data monitors this one uh, used for web server. A uh, semantic logon and other tune like WinCC OPC UA, OPC DAs, OPC 8 DAs, historic data access. Uh, OPC 8 and E server, alignment events. OPC UA, unified architect. Because we install foreign servers, so we only install WinC runtime professional. And another one, we run runtime client install for client. And we click accept and here price. And next. And security stores, uh, we have on the security, we updated in the security controls. Okay, uh, we have there's all the installations products and listed here. Okay, data monitors server. Data monitor client OPCs. Okay, WinCC runtime. 
install uh, estimate time remaining 57 minutes after installation after installation will uh, until you have this okay until until you have the license transfer you click skip license transfer you will transfer license at after you complete installation Let's see that's uh that checks and uh, until we have the restart computers we choose no because we want to transfer like a uh, license before we restart the computers. Okay, now we transfer Lysion. Open uh, simulations, Simatic EKBs. Okay, because we installed all Lysion already, now we only install the Simatic log into LAR and into SORC. Okay, now we don't have any missing license key in this uh, auto license managers. Uh, we check on the license. Web navigators, web navi web UX, uh, Windows Server and Time Professional. simulation okay we confirm on the software store and uh, no missing license thank you very much for your watching my video okay now we try to test uh, check their cement automation we go to option LMI tools you will see when you see web configurators okay when she run uh, when she see data configurators and sit run times run time advance or run time professional web UX configurators okay thank you Finish in installing. Thank you very much for your watching.